Hey y'all, it's your girl Courtney Shamars, and I'm back and I'm better with another video. And as y'all see by the title, I have made a part two to the Christmas tag video. And this time, I have Jerry Sinatra, as y'all see, my favorite guest. In the first part um, of the Christmas tag, I had Marez Canvas, so there will be a card above. So y'all click that link if y'all haven't saw the first tag. So y'all go do that. And if you're new to this channel, welcome, because I didn't give y'all a warm welcome, so there go y'all welcome. Make okay. sure y'all subscribe to your girl's channel. Subscribe. And we are going to get into the video. Okay. <laughs> okay, so the first question is, what is your favorite Christmas song? What's that one song where it's like, a boy and a girl, not finna sing it on camera, <laughs> but it's like, I don't know. Baby, I'm cold outside. Is that what it's called? I don't know. <laughs> <laughs> I think it's called Baby. I'm cold. Baby, it's cold outside. You uh, know? No. Uh, yes, you know. do. No, I don't. But I also love Ariana Grande song Santa Tell Me. Oh yeah, I like the Ariana Grande mm -hmm. Santa Tell Me and mm -hmm. Silent Night by The Temptations. So that's an old, old throwback song. I like. I really like this. Song. I'm gonna go with Ariana Grande Santa Tell Me because she just hits the perfect notes in it. Yeah, so. she do. What's your favorite thing about Christmas? My favorite thing about Christmas is um, giving and receiving. I love giving because like it's like when you give to somebody, you have that special feeling in your heart like <laughs> dang i'm somebody like this it's like a really good feeling i don't know how to explain it, but it's a good feeling and i love receiving gifts because, <laughs> <laughs> because i mean that's what it's for and then it's like right around right around the corner for my birthday so yeah i like it because i feel like i love christmas because i feel like the year is closing up so like if i had a bad year then it's like I'm get to, I'm gonna get to go to a new chapter of my life and do a new year and like restart over. But I also feel like if it's been a good year, then I'm gonna get to do a whole new year, which is gonna yeah. be even better than that year. Yeah. So I just feel like it's a good closing, and then I get to restart over thing, like a, a clean wash. True. What makes the holiday special for you? The holiday special for me is like I don't know. It's just like a feeling. Like I get to see like all these people like on social media with their families, and yeah. it's just like a warm feeling. Like. Everybody's just happy at this time. I but know. Some people aren't because they don't get to see their families. It's but true. I feel like it's just such a like, a like good you know, feeling. Yeah, yeah, like the the Christmas lights all over everywhere, snow, yeah, like people it's giving just, people stuff, people receiving yeah. gifts, and it's like a good thing because mm -hmm. it's like everybody be trying to come together. Your family come down here. Right. Well, some people family come down here and they get to the, see the rest of the family and. It's just nothing like seeing your family. Right. What would be your dream place to visit for the holiday season? Um, ooh, they call me on the spot. <laughs> I really don't know. That's how the last question did me. Um, New York. What the hell is Times oh, Square? Yes. And they get the they be some sometimes they be in the snow and the snow be falling down. You be in the camera, people be in the little camera kissing each other and stuff. And then like when it's finna hit twelve o'clock, they get to do the countdown. So Definitely. I'll pick New York because I mean you can meet a lot of people there because it's be tons of mm -hmm. people out there. So I'm gonna go with New York City Times Square. Ain't this what it's called? Mm -hmm. Great. <laughs> I'm going to have to go with London because okay. London's also a big city, but I feel like there everything's just so, the buildings are beautiful and when the snow hits and like it's like all just like, it's just <laughs> such a weird, like it's so beautiful there. Right. Like that'd be such a good place to have like the holidays like Christmas at. Mm -hmm. But I also feel like I would love to be at New York too because yeah. that countdown, man, they <laughs> right. never like It'd it. It'd be so lit. lit. I swear. <laughs> uh, oh, We got to go there one two. day. Hell yeah. yes. That's definitely on the bucket list. <laughs> what you like the uh, what you like the most? You stay in home with your family or travel with them on Christmas. Mm -hmm. So do you want to be with your family at home or travel with them on Christmas? Travel with them on Christmas. That's what I'm gonna say. Cause traveling, it, it is fun. You get yes. to see all types of stuff. So. 
And I feel like when you're sitting at home with them, it kind of gets like, if all your family visits and then you're all in one place, you kind of get sick of yeah, each other. Yeah, yeah. What's the best part about Christmas for you? The best part? Giving and receiving, basically. That's the best part. And then when you put up the Christmas tree and you put the little angel or star on top, that's the best thing, too. And then some people, they go out and set fireworks or have a fireworks show. So that's a good thing, too. I love those. I always go to those. So, yeah, that's my answer. Mine would be like outside by a campfire when like you and your family are out at the campfire roasting s'more not roasting s'mores but like making s'mores yeah. and like all the little kids is running in the background with sparklers and like y'all just yeah. having a freaking blast one time my dad mm -hmm. took me to this place where they were having a firework fight where they like wow. shoot fireworks at each other i don't know if to oh ask oh my him. god i remember that time i was at my grandma's house it was so many kids and they was like shoot me with fireworks so i just started crying and right back inside i was like i can't do this no more <laughs> i just started crying because <laughs> i couldn't handle that like no <laughs> oh my god okay gosh. the next question is what would you know what would be your dream place to visit for the holiday season when do you start getting excited for christmas Well, it depends, because some years it hits me early, but this year, like, it hasn't really hit me like it usually does. <laughs> like, I don't even got the tree up yet, okay? <laughs> so, I'm a little late this year, but this weekend I'm going to put on some Christmas music. I'm going to put the tree up, stockings. It's going to be looking cute, and we're going to get this Christmas vibe on, and I'm going to live out the last few days of Christmas. <laughs> well, like he said, it hit me at different times, but this time... It hit me like around Black Friday because after Black Friday, that's when people start basically gearing up for Christmas because they Black Friday be trying to get all types of gifts. So when they get those gifts, they basically be in the holiday mood like me. Well, most people, some people. And like it just hit me on Black Friday and like I'm so excited like. Oh my god. <laughs> like this Christmas. And then it's gonna be a new year. I'm so ready uh -huh. for the new year. Twenty nineteen. Yes, it's gonna be our year. Our year. I know y'all tired of hearing us saying it, but, <laughs> but it's it our is. year, like y'all just gonna have to wait on the Y'all gotta speak gonna it see. into existence, I'm telling y'all. Yes, that's why we keep saying it because we wanna speak it into existence so mm -hmm. it can happen. And it's gonna happen, we know. Oh, and if y'all don't realize it, we are matching. Yes. So explain. We are giving off Christmas colors. He is wearing red while I'm wearing the red eyeshadow. He is wearing, uh, I'm wearing green and he wearing green. So we both doing the different coordination. Y'all, we use the James said. Charles palette for this. Yes, we did. So that's how it look. And we went on live. We went on you now, Instagram live. And we did our makeup on there. Mm -hmm. And we had fun. Where do you usually spend your holiday? Usually, it's always at the house. Yeah. Same for me. Different houses each year because, yeah. you know. Yeah, true. Who do a lot of work in your family on Christmas Day? Well, for me, I don't know. Last year, I didn't even really spend Christmas with nobody. I spent it with myself. So, I guess people that do the most work is, like, the people that cook. So, like, my grandma or me yeah true i go with the same answer okay this is the very last answer y'all you have been granted one christmas wish what will it be <laughs> oh that's so hard um i'm gonna say bring my grandpa back like i miss my grandpa so i would say bring him back Everybody else, they can have anything in the world. I want my grandpa. That would be my only wish if I had one wish. So okay. that's what it would be. Mine would be for people to not see hate mm -hmm. at all. Like, all hate gone. Like, I feel that way, too. Because Cause there's so much hate in this world. Yes, it is. So, y'all, that is the end of this <laughs> video. I hope you guys liked it. Make sure y'all like, comment, and subscribe. Go to his channel. Make sure y'all check it out. His link will be below in the mm -hmm. description box. And see you guys in the next video.